Hi, I'm Dr. Jennifer Murdoch. Welcome to the fourth video in Section 8 of PESA Productions Thyroid Eye Disease 10-part series. In the previous three videos of this section, my colleague Dr. So Parker discussed the standard treatment options available to treat both the active and inactive phases of thyroid eye disease. I am now here to discuss the newest non-surgical treatment option available called TEPEZA. In early 2020, TEPEZA became the first FDA-approved treatment for thyroid eye disease, so let's learn a little bit more about it. While the information in this series is meant to be easily understood, some of the science behind TEPEZA can seem a bit complicated. Please feel free to review the information as often as you need. As always, we are available to provide more information about material discussed in this series or to accept any suggestions you may have to improve this series. You can find us on the web at www.plasticeyesurgery.com, email us at info at pesahouston.com, write to us at Plastic Eye Surgery Associates, 3730 Kirby Drive, Suite 900, Houston, Texas, 77098, or call us at 713-795-0705. Tepeza acts on the immune system by blocking a mediator in the inflammatory process called insulin growth factor 1 receptor, or IGF-1 receptor. The IGF-1 receptor is an important part of the immune process that drives the inflammatory and fibrotic changes seen in thyroid eye disease. Coupled with the thyroid stimulating hormone receptor, or TSH receptor, these two work together to activate inflammation in tissues around and behind the eye. As a result, the orbital fat and muscles that move the eye become enlarged and inflamed. Simultaneously, the eyelids start to retract, opening the eye more and more. All of these issues together in thyroid eye disease result in bulging eyes that are not adequately protected. In return, people suffer from eye pain, irritation, redness, dryness, double vision, vision loss, and horrible facial disfigurement. It is during this process of inflammation that eventually leads to permanent changes in the eyelids, eye muscles, and orbital fat. Tepeza works by binding to the IGF-1 receptor at the beginning of the inflammatory process and blocking all of the consequential inflammation thereafter. It basically presses the off button to shut off the inflammation in the tissues around the eyes. Therefore, not only does Tepeza stop thyroid eye disease from getting worse, it also has the potential to reverse some of the effects of eye protrusion or proptosis and eye muscle changes that can cause double vision. Extensive clinical trials conducted in accordance with FDA guidelines were completed to approve this treatment. 171 patients with thyroid eye disease in the active stage were enrolled in studies across the globe. Just as a reminder, the active phase is the beginning of the thyroid eye disease process when inflammation causes changes to the orbital tissues and we see symptoms arise or worsen. Patients were divided into two categories, those who received Tepeza and those who received placebo, or an inactive solution. In study patients who received Tepeza, there was a significant difference in the reduction of proptosis, meaning the protrusion of the eyes was reversed after receiving Tepeza. Along with decreasing proptosis, Tepeza was also found to significantly improve double vision, reduce swelling of the tissues behind the eye, and improve or resolve inflammatory signs like eye redness, swelling, and orbital pain. Tepeza is administered through a series of infusions, meaning it is an IV treatment. It is standard to start with eight infusions scheduled every three weeks, but your physician may adjust the dosing based on your response to the medication. While Tepeza is generally well tolerated, your physician can review the potential side effects of the treatment, which include muscle cramps and hyperglycemia. Wondering if Depeza is a treatment option for you? 
Dr. So Parker and I at Plastic Eye Surgery Associates would be happy to meet with you in consultation to discuss your individual needs. Thyroid eye disease is a complicated and debilitating disease, and we are here to find the right solution for you.